From your WordPress admin panel, go to WooCommerce Settings and then click the Checkout tab. Click the PayLeap link to open the Settings panel. Check the box to enable PayLeap and set your preferred title and description. For demo purposes, I will check the box to enable test mode and use my PayLeap test account to configure the plugin. You can do this with your own PayLeap test account during development of your site. To go live, you will follow the same process for the live API username and transaction key fields and make sure to uncheck the enable test mode box. To obtain API credentials, click the link provided to open the PayLeap account login. Log in to your PayLeap account. Click the Preferences menu item on the left to open its sub-items, and then click Create Transaction Key. Copy and paste the API login ID displayed to the API username field in the plugin settings. Return to the PayLeap account screen and click the Submit button under Create New Transaction Key. Copy and paste the transaction key value displayed into the API transaction key field in the plugin settings. Check the box to enable logging if you would like to store PayLeap API request and response logs on the server. This can be useful for troubleshooting purposes. Click the Save Changes button to submit your changes and officially activate the PayLeap payment gateway on your website. Now we will look at the shopping cart of our site where we can see that the PayLeap credit card option is displayed during checkout.